I decided to show you something that I'm using um, that I recently bought and um, I believe it's really um, interesting thing to be shown um, it's the camera and I bought it because um, I really like photography I do like taking the pictures and catching like the moments and you know stuff like that so I was searching on the internet and um, I was looking for a camera that like could be used um, for beginners I'm a beginner with the cameras. This is my first camera ever. So I found this camera, Canon by Canon, which is which has pretty decent features and with a reasonable price for that. So um, I'm not gonna make it long. I'm gonna start like talking about this. Um, beauty and in the meantime I will like develop the whole story so um, like let's start from the front part um, this is an objective which has the protecting like lid on, on the top and you can remove the lid by squeezing these two buttons outside or the inside so you can squeeze them like that and here we go there's um, a lens really large one which creates um, well the lens is not creating but it's giving um, really um, good and sharp pictures so when you want to put it back just squeeze this two and just put it there like that yeah so um and it's some um, mirrorless camera and I'm gonna show you what that means it actually cannot work without any lens I didn't know about that so I, I know now <laughs> there is a button here which when you press I'm gonna go like this I press and the lens pop out I mean the objective so this is how it looks without um, the see. And when I want to put it back, I just go like this. I just catch the perfect. Um, it's like robbing the safe. of the, the you know the whole case it's well it's pretty decent it's made of different materials from the plastic to the metal and some sort of um, fake leather so um, hmm. there is a button here which without you cannot take the pictures you have to pull it like up, rotate, and you hear heard the click. So, and like you can take the pictures with it. 
and you can just you know just it depends what do you need um it does have 15 18 24 28 35 and 40 um five i believe it's the zooming it does have something with the zoom um i have to learn a lot about it but um i learned to take um pictures like a good one according to me <laughs> so um, let me just end when you want to take this back you just press the same button here and just everything is so smooth and um everything works really um like smoothly and it's everything it's quiet it's just about the clicks and stuff like that um so the holder here is made of as i mentioned like plastic or full, false um fake leather um it's a good you know it's good when you want to to hold the camera um there's also their um, logo um on the top of the camera we have a flash which i didn't know it it was a flash i'm a very curious person but um for a couple of days i haven't read the manual instructions so i like just experimented a bit and one day i just randomly opened like this I thought this was removing so that you could put a flash like on top of it like the big one um, and you can actually do that by sliding something here maybe the mic probably and maybe the some larger flash with you know um, that can light up like bigger space so um and the flash is here just and that's it and as i said everything is quiet everything is kind of smooth and everything stays in place that's why i chose this camera because i wanted something with a good quality and as i said the reasonable price i didn't want to pay two thousand for example for a camera or three thousand this was um a lot less but it's um, um, it can serve my um, inspiration and creativity that I have in the moment. So um, in the moment of taking the picture, <laughs> um, and the, the the flashlight, it's like kind of big. It's really big, and it can light up a really like large space it's sometimes i try to take my pic pictures pictures of myself and some other people just for fun and um, it's kind of you know kind of make you blind for a second <laughs> um but it's good it's really good and the quality of the camera it's um pretty much amazing you can zoom in the raw pictures and a lot of details you know preserved and stuff like that so um on the top of the camera we have this large button which is for yeah shooting and we have this red one here which is for recording you can record the videos um 4k videos which is great and um this button here you can see that um it does show um the types of the scenes for example um like the scenes like in intelligent one where they where the camera set up everything like for you according to you know the like environment you're surrounded by um you have also for example the focus where you focus the person and um where the background is blurred it has a lot of effects really a lot of effects um it does have i don't know 
um, hmm, manual exposure um, where when um, there's light behind you and stuff like that and um, it really does a good job really really good job um, there's this button which says M F N this right here and um, I do not really what it what it is for really I press it but like nothing happened don't know like no, don't, don't know why and here we have this metal which are really you know tough metal holders where you can put this thing and you can put this around your neck but um thing is I don't know how to how to um, let me just okay. the thing is I I didn't know how to um, put this into this I mean it's kind of large for it I don't know and I quit it but recently I went on a holiday and I saw some people who had their cameras similar to this one I mean the size was similar I don't know the model and their cameras were around their neck and um, which is good why because um, this camera is not that large like according to the size but it's kind of heavy it's not that heavy but you still like should carry it and you know you can feel it all the time and um, especially when it's hot and it's certainly heavier than the mobile phone um, and I had to like going with with it like this or with both hands because um, I was afraid that it might you know slip her through my hands and fall down and well that would be an end of a cre creative era so um, yeah well um so i will look up for some tutorial to see how should i put this i mean i'm not stupid i probably know if i like tried but um um you know it's it was a confusing in the moment and i just didn't pay attention to it anymore it has this um you know the the model and I'll put a link in the description with the model so you can find it if you know someone wants to buy it or like try it so yeah and um, we have the space for the mic here and for the um, um, HDMI cable and also for the button for the Wi-Fi but the Wi-Fi is connecting automatically it's probably already activated um, what I do love about this device is also that um, the Canon has its own app on um, app stores and you can like download it on, their, on your phone um, connect um, you know import the photos from the camera to your phone the one you want and that's it and I I um, put my photos through the Adobe Lightroom with slight effects and you know a little bit of grain and, or something like that so um, because I love that um, edited look but not over edited just a bit you know just a pinch of editing like less is more um so and of course we have this i'm gonna open first um no i'm gonna show you the buttons first we have the buttons here and this one here is for um like entering the gallery this one is for um, menu for the settings we have this circle the bottom of it is deleting the photos 
the right is turning off the flashlight or on um, the left one is let me just see oh it's about um, auto or um, manual focus and the top is for the contrast which I like don't know um, and there is info info button which you can use for 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 to see the hmm, the image uh, image um, hmm, statistics while taking the picture the situation exposure um, contrast um, grayscale I don't know like a lot of stuff mm, and we have here the this um the zoom button but you can also do that on the screen and we have this one i don't know what what this button represents so if someone could tell me like i never like searched so yeah and the back is also made of some sort of i call it fake like leather but it's not it's plastic and like, this is like the imitation the pattern of the leather so the screen is open like this it's really large it's kind of dirty a bit um a lot <laughs> oh my god i haven't cleaned it i mean why is that because it really really catches everything like even if your hands are clean um so i don't know i don't have any excuse but why should i um so and the sensor for taking the photos for example if you want to um look through this there is a like probably a laser here and when you put your eye here or something it automatically um turns on and the screen turns off so um for most of the time i look through this because it gives me more like I, I'm more precise when I look through it through the sensor. Um, okay. Um, the screen rotates like towards me in the back, which is good for taking the selfies, for example, or recording something. But um, it's been a month since I have this camera, and. Um, I found out that this screen can be rotated towards towards me and that it can you know, put like oh my god this is so 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 dirty I don't know why I don't have anything um maybe I can go with my um blouse which is clean I suppose but yeah I hate when this happens really but um it's probably from you know typing on it and I haven't noticed but it's okay um so the screen it's kind of really large and it's really sensitive to the touch also like the phone you know nowadays phones so um it shows like the really like the true colors there are like outside um and when I was on holiday, when I was taking the pictures, I was taking through this lens and like this, I was going like this and trying not to break the screen when I just could put it like this. The adjusting is good for the angles when you are like trying to um, take a photo with a specific angle or something, but um, I like didn't need it at that moment and um, I just um you know they didn't know that it could go like this as i said i haven't read the manual so um yeah um it's a really nice camera and um let me just take this and here there's nothing in here so it's um an empty empty space outside you can close like that and what I like I said that at the, at the beginning um, 
everything is quiet, everything is clicking so nicely and so gently, it doesn't make any necess unnecessary um, noises and stuff like that, so, um, yeah, I mean, I'm really, really, really um, satisfied with it, and, um, you know, it does have a lot of, as I said, like, materials and types of, you know, um, um, you know, feelings on the fingers, plastic, metal, um, this is a bit, you know, sharp, sharpie, um, the, the flash here, it's a diff, uh, made of a different, um, the whole flashlight is made of a different material than this regular plastic, this here, it's kind of like rubbery, um, this here is also rubbery but more plastic, this is made of some really um really 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 nicely designed um hmm, rubber uh which really um fits your um like eye area it doesn't um, make you any traces or something or like redness which is really good so um and on the bottom of course i, f I forgot we have um the hole on the bottom how can i forget about that um um for the um, tripod or some something else where you can you know just put your camera and we have this area here which is for um battery and memory card yeah so it does have this rubber which you can just pull like this Oops, open it and the first tiny slide here is for card, this one larger is for the battery. So we can go like this and like that. And this is everything that, I, that the camera contains, about the physical stuff um, for the buttons and you know, stuff like that. And I still don't know what is like this part for. I mean, I know it's for the mic, but I don't know if it's for some larger flash or it can have some other purpose because um, the entrance is important and what's on the top, I believe it's not. I mean, you cannot put a camera there, but you can put some something else. Um, so, yeah. It's a really interesting camera. So I hope you enjoyed and um, see you next time.